Men are very logical thinkers. We're, we don't speak in code. We say what it is. That's it. And again, we're focusing on good men. So don't start with the, well, these dudes be saying all this, that, and the other and confusing you. Those are not good men. Those are men who are not meant to be in your life. They do not apply to what I'm talking about here. But a good man and a man who's serious about you, all right, he's looking to have transparency. He doesn't want to play this I have to figure you out game, all right? It's not that he won't love you enough to want to try to dig deeper and discover things on his own, but don't make it stressful for him. He's not looking for the woman who's going to make it this constant process of having to, uh, what's the word, interpret and analyze and figure out and connect the dots on his own. That's stressful. That's exhausting. So when a woman can be transparent, when she can be forthcoming, that is welcomed, again, by the good man, by the man who's serious about you. He wants and needs and desires your transparency. He wants you to tell him what's wrong. He wants you to tell him when you desire something. He wants you to let him know what you want to eat that day. <laughs> like, some of you can't even tell him that. And that's just not really a big one, but I'm just saying, like, he wants transparency. And when you can provide that, that's definitely going to attract them to you because in, for a lot of men, that's not something that they get from the average woman. It feels like a game of having to figure things out, which is why you hear uh, men complain about how confusing women are. Because women will say, well, they're communicating, but in reality, they're communicating in a way that they feel conveys the message, but to that man, it's not coming across clearly. Because she's not really being transparent. She's speaking in a way that she feels like you should be able to figure this out or, and see beyond what's going on. Now, I'm not saying every woman behaves that way, but that is very common. So when you can provide transparency, trust and believe that is definitely something a good man values and desires in a woman. Number four, the number four thing men really want in a woman is a willingness to listen. All right. So you heard transparency just now. We want you to be able to tell us what's going on and be forthcoming, forthcoming and honest. But we also want you to be willing to listen to when we have something to say to you. Now, please do not be quick to jump and, and think this is about just taking orders and doing as I say. No, 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 no. It, it's simply about starting with just be willing to listen. Many times men find themselves in situations or with women who are talking over them, who are just listening to rebuttal, who aren't actually listening. She's hearing him, all right? She hears the audible voice in her ears, but she's so busy processing and analyzing, she's not listening to him. And so a lot of men stop talking and expressing themselves to that woman because they feel like it's pointless. They're not being heard. Now, of course, it's on that man to recognize that if you cannot talk to this woman, why are you even with her? But this video is about what men really want in a woman. And so I want the women to be aware that, yes, you have to show a willingness to listen. You have to show a willingness to pause yourself, stop overthinking in that moment, and just listen to what he has to say and not overanalyze what he's saying. So, for example, quick story. Uh, there was once a, a person I know who went to a counselor with their husband. At the time, I wasn't available to help them out. And so the counselor had him do an exercise where she asked the husband to tell the uh, wife how he felt. And he went on and said how he felt and expressed himself. And then she asked the wife, repeat verbatim what he just said. And they spent over the next hour without the wife being able to say exactly what the husband just said. It was a bunch of, well, I think you mean this, or what, what you're trying to say is that she was essentially constantly interpreting, analyzing, and, and twist, not twisting it like she's trying to manipulate the words, but she wasn't processing it just as he said it. And so a lot of women don't always realize that you're not processing it just as he said it. And again, some of this is due to the fact that you're so used to dealing with wrong men, bad men, that who are being manipulative and lying, that you have to now try to figure out what the real message is and what's really going on, that now you don't know how to take a man's word who is a good man, 
who is trying to be honest with you and forthcoming. You think it's something else going on when it's really not. You've got to be willing to embrace what he's saying. So you've got to be willing to listen. He wants a woman who is willing to listen. When you don't show that quality, you make it very difficult for a man to embrace wanting to be serious with you in a relationship. Hey, thank you for watching this video. Be sure to check this one out right here. And I'll see you there. Relationships are the key to a successful life. But there's five areas that we have to be mindful of when it comes to relationships. There's relationship with God, relationship with ourselves, relationship with family and friends,